Hello everyone, I'm Adreza. Welcome back. Well, by seeing the title of this video, you might know the topic of today's video. Yes, this is one of the most suggested comments that I have found on my previous videos. And the question is how to improve fluency or how to be fluent in English. Many people who struggle while speaking in English have this question. How to be a fluent speaker? Well, I have seen a lot of videos on this topic on YouTube. Some videos say be fluent in English within 20 days or tips to improve English within just one week or seven days. Now, I'd like to say something here that it's not a magic medicine that you will take in and be fluent suddenly one day. To be good at something, we need to practice. And if you want to be good at English, if you want to speak English fluently, then you need to practice. The first most important step, and I guess you all know it, is practicing, speaking. No matter how much good at grammar you are, no matter how much good at the subject English you are, until and unless you speak with your own voice, you will not be able to speak in English fluently, smoothly. Now tell me, you are fluent at your mother tongue, right? Now think, how did you reach that point of fluency at your mother tongue? How? It's because you literally use that language every day with your friends, with your family, at your workplace maybe. You always use that language. So when you started with that language, you used it every day and that is how you turned this fluent. That is what you exactly need to do with the language English. To be fluent, just use it. Write practice and practice. Now, tell me what is fluency? Fluency is speaking without any error or speaking without getting stuck. Right. But never think that to be fluent, you need to talk fast. Okay. You need to increase your speed. Never. Speed actually never matters. You are learning the language to express your emotions, to express your feelings, right? Some people might speak fast, some people might speak slower, right? It never matters. Fluency just means speaking without getting stuck, right? And for that, you need to practice. Now, another thing that I'd like to say here is vocabulary. Well, when you start your practice, then at first just have the limited amount of vocabulary that you need in your mind. Like, what is the limited amount of vocabulary that you need? Just the vocabulary to express your feelings. Never think that if I use more advanced words, more beautiful words, then maybe I am more fluent. No, it's not that. Using hard words, it's not a part of fluency. Just expressing your feelings is the part. So first, start with easy vocabulary, okay? Don't first go into learning advanced words, learning hard words. Start with easy vocabulary. Just try to speak it out. If you get stuck, if you are not able to find a word that you need to express, then search that word. Right, search that word and then use that vocabulary. So that is how you improve your vocabulary. Well, if you want later, then of course you can advance your vocabulary, right? Now listen to the sentences that I'm saying. Am I using quite hard or advanced vocabulary? No, right? But am I able to express what I'm trying to say to you? Yes. So this is all that you need. Like easy vocabulary, just you need to know how to form sentences with those words and that will come only when you practice. Now another thing, well if you really want to be fluent at speaking English, you need to practice but you need to do it daily. Right, wrong, easy, hard, whatever you know, just speak it out but make sure to do that daily. Uh, what I mean is never skip a few days. If you start from today, make sure to be consistent with your plan. Never skip, suppose you do two days, 
the next two days you skip because you probably did not find the time it should not happen like that just fix half an hour or not like that suppose you're thinking about something then just try to form sentences with that and speak it out right do not think of this as a work or do not think of learning english as you learn a subject just do it in your spare time make it your hobby speaking in english right that is how you will also feel interested in speaking in english and make sure to be consistent because consistency is the key to perfection if you want to perfect your speaking skills if you want to be fluent then you need to practice but practice it consistently practice it daily look english is a language and a language isn't that hard to be perfect at to be fluent at you have learned a lot in your childhood days science math so many hard hard topics right that you had to memorize i need to memorize a lot right now so from that i think if you look at learning a language then it is very easy if you could memorize those hard definitions those hard terms then learning a language being fluent at a language is basic okay and believe me english is much easier to learn than any other language so this is what i wanted to share with you today and i'm sure that if you follow this then you will soon be fluent at english just remember that being perfect at something needs hard work and passion so make sure to have that so this was for today if you like this video click on the like button and if you have any other suggestions regarding the next video then do not forget to write it down in the comment box below and if you haven't subscribed my channel yet then make sure to click on the subscribe button that's it for today meet you in the next video thank you bye